YouTube. <laughs> Welcome to episode two of the Pitch of Boone Motorbike Tour series. Today, I'm leaving Lloyd and I'm headed south. I could take the main road that goes from Lloyd to Pitch of Boone and be there in about two hours. But that's not how I do shit on this channel. I'm gonna be headed south, jump off the main highway, explore some back roads, and see if I can find some adventures. I just did an engine swap on the RX 155 last night. Let me know if you can tell what engine's in it. Ready? I decided to go ahead and fill up with gas. 60 baht, three US dollars fills me all the way up from a half a tank. Thank you, cop, cop and cop. Hello. I think she works at the uh, BJ station. I could be wrong, I don't know. Should I go in here? Um, okay, five minute break uh, on filming. I'll be back. You will not believe what I just passed in the middle of this village. In the middle of nowhere. Look at this. What? Holy crap. Look at these civics. Oh. What? Look at this. Hello. 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 <laughs> This is definitely something I did not expect to see in a random tiny village in Isan. What the hell? <laughs> YouTube. <laughs> famous. You will be famous. Two. You. White. People always ask me how I'm able to travel the world comfortably. And the answer to that is because I am a car guy. And no matter where you are in the world, no matter what language you speak, if you're a car guy, you will always find other car guys and you will always have friends no matter where you go. Even in a tiny village in the middle of fucking nowhere, Isan. I love it, man. Just 30 minutes later, and the scenery has totally changed. I've noticed an increase in altitude, a decrease in temperature, and songs like that one. Curvy roads ahead. Hell yeah, son. Let's go. I've actually been to this three-way road before. I rode this section of this road on my Isan Thailand motorbike tour series. Yeah. I'm really close to the road. I don't feel super comfortable here. The past hour or so, I've been, holy shit. The past hour or so, I've been on this road. Smooth surfaces, little to no traffic, but this way is where the roads are actually going to get good. Honestly, I really needed to stop after being on the bike for the past couple hours. Like, my butthole was numb. It actually reminds me of that night in Pattaya in 2017 when I, um, actually, never mind, never, never, never mind. 
We are now entering Nam Nao National Park. It's a pretty beautiful park. I rode through it before. They even have elephant crossings here. Last time, I wasn't able to see any actual elephants. Hopefully my luck changes this time. Look at how full they put these trucks. Look at that. That shit would never pass in America. But check this out. Elephant crossing. When's the last time you've seen a sign that looked like that? God, I hope I see an elephant. Ooh. The roads here are pretty good. We're all really fast sweepers. Great road surface. Man, they're not technical, but they're still fun. There's an elephant crossing sign. Where are the elephants? elephant poop. How do you do an elephant mating call? I don't think that's right. If you know how to do an elephant mating call, uh, please leave a comment below so in the future I know how to attract elephants and hopefully don't get fucked by one. That, 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 that would be my luck. Dude, I've been rolling full throttle. Look at this. That's like, that's all it has. Full throttle for like 15, 20 minutes. Just sweeper, 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 sweeper. Pretty good. You guys see any elephants? You see any elephants? Where? Ah. No way. How long did that take? Wow! Bye bye! Those monks are walking to Kun Ken. It's a four hour motorbike ride from here to Kun Ken, and they're walking. I remember this from last time! This bridge is amazing! One of the most epic bridges I've ever been on in my life! Look at this! Shit! Hell yes! Man, what a beautiful bridge. Okay, I'm only about 45 minutes out from Pichabun, so it's time to hit the road once again. Yeah, I need one of these guys. I think next year is gonna be time to upgrade. Look at that! I'm full throttle! There's nothing I can do, are you kidding me? I think it is safe to say that I've made it to the city of Pichabun. That last hour sucked. Now I need to find a hotel, and get a beer. It's been a long day. Good day, but a long day. Cheers, guys. I've officially made it to the city of Pichaboon. Such a cool little town. I had no idea this existed. It's very local. Uh, I don't think you're gonna see any other foreigners here. I'm gonna be spending the night here in this little city. And then we're headed back north to one of the most epic roads in all of Thailand. Stay tuned. I appreciate you watching to the end and I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.